Have you ever seen a guy slap shot into an empty net before? I have. What do you think of Morgan Riley's reaction to really Greg's slap shot into the empty net? I thought it was appropriate. Does Morgan Riley's reaction to the empty net goal encapsulate the frustration of this game that you guys were feeling? No, that has that had nothing to do with it. Um, just a, a stupid thing to do by, by their guy there at the end. Slap shooting it? Yeah. And something that reporters are asking about and got Morgan Riley ejected from the game is this one right here. Roughly 13 seconds left. 4-3 Ottawa, Morgan Riley tries to move the puck, which is blocked by Ridley Gregg and ends up on Shane Pinto's stick. Riley steps in with the attempt to regain possession, but this leaves Gregg off to the races on the empty net. Does, does this guy not get to about the hash marks and just fucking rifles it in like he's in the hardest shot competition at the All-Star game? Morgan Riley retaliates by skating over and cross-checking him right in the face. I'm not surprised Morgan Riley retaliated. I am a little surprised that A, he cross-checked him in the face, and B, Ridley Gregg's just out on a free skate after the goal, like Morgan Riley is his body, he's coming over to say hello, doesn't brace himself at all, and just takes the cross-check right to the dome. Not gonna lie, this was pure entertainment. Of course, they pan over to Reeves on the bench, mean mugging, looking like an ogre, ready to go in with the battle. With five seconds on the clock, we all kind of knew they weren't going to let that happen. And as a side note, I also love this clip of the Leafs fan ranting to his sense buddy. He even crosses the arms in everything to show he's not happy about this. And his buddy's just sitting there laughing it off. I probably found that funnier than it was. But yeah, that made me laugh when I saw that. Ridley eventually picks himself up off the ice. Now armed with the knowledge that Morgan Riley was not there just to say hello. <laughs> With no with no context on this play, it has shades of Dale Hunter, Pierre Turgeon, but it's not. With some context, they're completely different scenarios, that's for sure. With that being said, Morgan Riley is for sure going to get suspended. The question is, how long? Originally, when I asked myself that, due to the NHL's inconsistency with suspension, fines, I had no idea what to think. I'm glad I'm not the only one, because I've been seeing people say as little as two games, to as much as five games minimum. I'm just going to throw it out as a guess and go with three games, but I really have no idea. You never know with the NHL though. Like Riley has no history. Is Gregor going to miss time? Do they take the context of the goal into perspective? Technically, it's not against the rules, but we all know with that type of action, it will draw a crowd. Once again, that's why it's hilarious that Greg was just skating about his day after clapping it in on the empty net on the hash marks. Let me know your opinion on the incident as a whole. Once again, I just found it pure entertainment from the outside looking in. I don't have any real strong opinions here. How long do you think Riley gets suspended for? If you're watching this after the suspension is released, do you agree with it? Go full blast in the comment section. Say what's on your mind. And if you made it this far, clap the like button into an empty net. Subscribe. And until next time, okay guys?